I recently hit 1,000 subscribers and I asked my comment section to give me the craziest questions they can give me and they delivered. JYXO says, do you like cheese? Yeah, who doesn't? Still Not Bitten says, console or PC? Yeah, PC all the way because console, I just don't like controllers. I don't like any of that and the customization is awful. Ethan Plays says, who are your favorite upcoming Hive YouTubers? So when I think upcoming, I think below 1K. So my favorites are Rainbow Saber, who's been a long time friend of mine and he has just a voice for content and probably Mr. Nemo because he's just freaking hilarious. J Gaming says, how did you get your name? My name came from a old username that I had to have for a homeschool thing. And my family always called me dude from practically when I was born. So, and Dragon just came from because why not? So I just smushed it together, became a good username when I was 13 when I started up my channel. Went, hmm. Why not just keep what it was? Dream Standard XD says, which YouTuber inspired you to start YouTube? So when I was 13, that's when I first got YouTube, when I first started watching YouTube, when I got permission to do all that. I started to watch a lot of Minecraft content because that's what I was just interested in. So I watched a lot of EY Stream and Technoblade. But the person who really inspired me to really start was EY Stream. And that's why all my videos have face cam in it. Just, I was copying him for the most part. JPM the Gamer says, what is your inspiration to start YouTube? And who is your favorite YouTuber? My inspiration was basically, I just love creating videos. I created videos when I was like eight. And I just had absolutely no idea what I was doing, but I just loved making and editing it with iMovie. So I just decided to make a whole bunch of content. Now, none of it was on YouTube. None of it was there. I just made it for my own enjoyment. But my favorite YouTuber, I don't really watch YouTube just to sit down and enjoy it anymore. I'll do it a little bit, but usually when I do that, I'm tired and I just scroll through shorts. But if I had to say what my favorite YouTuber is, it's either going to be Zolister, Lil Mac, Radunes, or Queso. Guardcraft says, if you wanted to collaborate with any other YouTuber, who would it be? Alive, it would be Zolister because he's just so smart with content and he just chooses different approaches and I just really respect that. And dead would be Technoblade because, you know, he's the best. Still Not Ben says, when do you realize slash do you plan you would actually do YouTube as your job? When I realized that I would want to do YouTube as a job was the moment I started because I just love doing it and I just really hope that I can work hard enough to get it to be the point where I can actually do it full time. Still Not Benton says, do you plan to quit or retire after a period of time? Absolutely not. If I have the option to create YouTube videos, I will create YouTube videos no matter what. It will just depend. If it doesn't turn out to be my job, I'll still do it part time because I just love doing it. Still Not Benton says, do you plan to go to college? Yes, I plan to go to college to study film, AI, or game design, it just, I need to decide, it's just, it is what it is. Griffin Plays says, which videos do you think would trend on YouTube right now? Because I just started a YouTube channel, I need some good content. So, if you're planning to do Minecraft content like me, it's on the decline right now, and there's really no doubt about that Minecraft has been on a decline for a little bit now. There isn't many trends you can jump on that isn't dying. But if you can find out something that someone else hasn't done before, or just squish together a whole bunch of things people have done before, and then just make some crazy idea, then you definitely will be able to create a trend. The Enderbro says, how do you make your thumbnails? I use Canva.com, I use the pro version of it. And I just take a whole bunch of screenshots 
then I will adjust the colors and all that. Then I'll just smush them together. And then it'll just make a thumbnail. That for mirror is that how you say it? I don't even know. When did you start posting good quality videos? At amount of subs and when? This is pretty relative because if you asked me a year ago, I would think my content was amazing. But looking back now, it's pretty trash. But I mean, it's it depends where you're at. It just means you need to keep on growing. At this point, I probably don't have the greatest content. It's just everything is set to go up from here. Still Not Bitten says, do you have a prime in PvP? If you mean like at what time was my best, I think it's now because I actually have gotten good. If you looked at me a year ago, I was really, really terrible, but I've gotten much, much better. But if you're asking for what game mode, Sky Wars, Hive Sky Wars is my best game mode. Just because that's the game mode I've played for a long, long time. Let's see, Wazmu says, What is the most impressive thing that you think you've ever done? I don't really know, honestly. So y'all tell me in the comments. See what y'all think it is. Let's see, E Nation Official says, When can I make Emberthorn V3? That's up to you. Whenever you want to, you make it, send it to me, and I'll, I'll deal with the rest. Giddle says, What is your favorite moment on the Dragon SMP? It's either going to be the pre-lore or the post-lore type section. I loved it when it was everyone was together, but it made interesting content either way. Let's see, Lugia21 says, will you invite big YouTubers to the SMP? I will try my best, but there's no guarantee. Let's see, Gil Dude says, what are some juicy Dragon SMP3 leaks that you could share with us? So what I got for Dragon SMP Season 3 is there's going to be a bar that you can grow or shrink with the amounts of deaths, amount of kills, some achievements, um, when you craft custom items, and the bar will determine what buffs you have, what debuffs you have, and if you run out of everything, you're going to be turned to spectator like last season. Gil Dude says, who's your favorite, me or chicken? Mm, both. See, Dream Standard XD says, How did you start Dragon SMP? So, I started Dragon SMP Season 1 about a year ago. It's probably in February is when I started it. Last February, I think. And that was because I wanted to join this other YouTuber SMP, and I was terrible. So, they rejected me. So I decided to make my own and it did pretty decent considering it where I was at. But then a couple months ago I started the Dragon SMP Season 2, which I started because my Hive content was really on a decline. And most Hive content is on a decline right now. But I started Dragon SMP Season 2 and my content's really grown ever since that. Giddle Dude says, Is three questions too much for one person to ask on a community post? Probably. Razor Shells says, Hair Reveal. And Still Not Bitten says, Take the cap off one time for this one time. I don't know why y'all want this, but I did make a promise. I don't know why any of y'all want this, but... The hat is my brand, but if y'all want to see, there we go. This is the hair. I don't know why most of y'all wanted this so bad. It's like people with face reveals, I don't understand it, but I mean, here you go. I don't know what else y'all want.